Hey, what's up, YouTube? Uh, it's Gorby here. Um, I just want to talk about a topic that a lot of African kids can relate to. And it's about African parents. And you know how strict they can be. I mean, seriously, like me personally now, I'm from Cameroon. But um, <clears throat> there are a lot of things I've been hearing from Nigerian kids. African parents are just sometimes can be the worst. I mean, seriously. Like as I said, I'm from Cameroon, but I'm going to put on an Nigerian action just to show you what I mean. So you know when you're in primary school and you're sitting at the back of the class, whatever, messing with your friends, and your teacher's like, Gorby, what did I tell you about being quiet? And I'm like, sorry, miss. And she gives you like three warnings. And then she calls you the third time and she be like, Gorby, bring me your note. Bring me your journal. I'm going to give you a note home. And you be like, oh, shit. And you weren't afraid to get the note. It's just what would happen when you got home. So you'd be like, okay, but please, miss. You'd be like, no, 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 give me your, give me your journal. That's too much. So then you're, you're going up, and then you wait. You count the minutes until the bell rings for home time. And you know that when that bell rings, you're going to walk as slow as possible. Because when you get home, you know what's going to happen. So me, now I get home, and I'd walk into the, to the sitting room. My mom probably be eating her lunch or something. And I'd be like, uh, hi, mom. Good afternoon, mom. Is like, yes, how was your day? Hope you were behaving yourself. And she'd be like, and I'd be like, yes, 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 I was. Um, so I got a note home. You got what? What? What did you say? T say it again. Say it again because I did not hear you. I got it like that. And you'd be like, eh? Notes. Did I bring you to this country so you can be getting notes? Oh, yeah, bring me this note over here. Let me read it. So you walk over slowly, slowly, you'd be afraid. Oh, yeah, come over here now. What did I say? Bring me that note. So you go, you give her the note, and you just step, you take one or two steps back. She reads the note out loud. I want to inform you that Gorby was being very rowdy in class and was not listening to a single thing that I said. And you know the teacher always makes it out worse than it actually is. And she'd be like, eh. So every morning when I get you ready for school and I tell you, okay, have a nice day at school, listen to the teacher, and you're like, yes, mom, you go and do this, eh? Eh? You go and do this. You be like this. She be like, why are you crying? Why did I, did I hit you? Did I hit you? You be like, I swear. <laughs> having a childhood was not the best thing ever. So then she be, you be crying, you be crying, and she be like, so you are going there to disgrace me, Abby. Eh? Or yeah, go to your room, no dinner. Oh, man. And another thing is, you know, when you go shopping with your mom and your mom be like, okay, oh yeah, come here, before we enter this store, don't look at anything, don't touch anything, and don't ask me for anything. And if I hear you just go, mommy, there'll be no more mommy. I'll be a lone parent. I won't even be a parent because you'll not be around. Oh, man. I mean, seriously, though, African parents are, sometimes can be so tough. I remember one day I was watching, um, what's it called? What's that show called again? Dynamo, uh, Magician Impossible. He was doing that trick where he's in uh, Rio de Janeiro. Rio de Janeiro and he's like this and he's levitating in the air. My mom walked in on that and she was like, what? So you're not worshipping the devil. I'm like, mom, no, it's just a magic. I don't care what it is. If it is not humanly possible, it is the devil's work. I'm like, mom, calm down. I said, don't tell me to calm down. Before I just give you one slap like that. Oh yeah, turn off the TV. In fact, I'll cancel this guy. I'll be like, eh? Mom, now, why? You know, oh, shit. 